except for this little tail here. Let's see. Oh no, it's already popping out of my ear. Forget it. It's hard to do this one-handed, I'll tell you that much. Unintentionally, I guess you would say that I saved the best for last. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm on the mission to find earplugs that are comfortable and work well. So, I purchased three different affordable to not affordable earplugs on Amazon. I have this X-Fit earplug. I purchased all of these just based on they had good reviews. These are Eros. These are Motosafe. Lastly, these are just your basic earplugs. You can get them at every CVS, Walmart. So I'm going to give each of these a try for half a day while we're away. And I'm going to, along the way, give a little review of how they're working out for me. All right, I'm going to give these standard foam earplugs uh, a shot. So these you have to kind of twist around in your fingers so that they will fit in your ears. I'll probably have to do this a few times to get it so that it goes in there quite right. I'm going to have to give that a shot again. Alright, here we go. Okay, these little foam ones, I've had them in for about an hour and a half and 52 miles. They um, sort of really bothering my one ear, but sound wise, I cannot hear anything. These are really good for ear protection, but uh, I'm gonna put them back in when we, after breakfast and wear them for about the same amount of time and see if I still have the same problem. Uh, maybe it was just uh, the way I put them in last time. We'll see. All right, we've done another, I don't know, 50 some miles and eh, 70. And these hurt when you hit like 47, 50 miles. Uh, I like how they, um, they're definitely really good at deadening the sound. And when I'm not on the bike, I can peel, hear almost nothing. <laughs> um, but I guess the foam starts coming out of your ear or something after so many miles, but uh, I'm gonna switch to another set of earplugs and we'll test those out. These are, I don't know how I feel about these yet. I don't have much to compare to. We'll see. All right, I'm just gonna try these Nidrati XFIT earplugs for this next round. I don't even know how these are gonna look. Oh, little case that they come in, that's kind of nice. Oh, these feel really, really soft. Very light and very soft. Wow. I can't. I mean, they almost feel velvety. That's pretty wild. All right, so those go in really easy. Not like the foam ones. The foam, you have to like squeeze, 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 get them to go in and fit them in your ear. But these, well, kind of impressed already how easy they just kind of slide in and, and tuck into your ear. All right, got it. All right, well, we'll give these a try on this go round. First, I want to say when I was putting these in before, I put them in on the wrong side. There's little um, 
R and a little L on it. So I did put them in correctly for the ride. We went, I think 80 or 90 miles, probably more like 80. These didn't hurt at all. And the sound dampening is amazing. In fact, when I got off the bike, I was trying to talk to Alex and he was like, you have to take those out, you're screaming. Uh, so, so far, I'm really liking these. So I think those earplugs work pretty well. My ear was a little itchy when I got off the bike, but I've had something in my ear all day, so I kind of think that's what it's from. Um, so far, I like those way better than the foam ones, so we'll see what the next pair ends up being like. All right, for half of the day today, I'm gonna try these Eros earplugs. I'm gonna pull them out of the box now. I don't even know what they look like. Oh, all right. These are really tiny. And it looks like these have uh, two different sizes that I can place in my ears. I'm not gonna mess up like I did last time. This one says R for right. Be a little smarter this time. Let's see how this works. Hmm, these are much bigger and harder than those white ones I used yesterday. I'll tell you right now, these are really uncomfortable. They're very hard, and uh, I don't know if these are gonna last long in my ears at all. So, uh, come in and we'll see. All right, so these Eros earplugs, they're going in the trash. I put them in my ear and they feel awful. I'm not even willing to put my helmet on with them. So these, I would not recommend. So the last set of earplugs I am going to try then are these Moto Safe earplugs by Alpine. They come with this little tiny zipper case. That's kind of cute. It's not a hard case, but it has a um, little key ring here that you can stick it on your keys. And these are super tiny, very soft. You can use it in either ear. So let's see here. Okay, those go in really easy. And they're really soft. But, I mean, so far, oh, wait a minute. Now I got that one in more. All right, they're in. Let's get on the road and check them out. So I actually read the directions on these now. And apparently you're supposed to put the earplug in this little who thing, who jobber thing. And then you put it in your ear and you push it in and pull it out. That does not feel like it's in my ear at all. I'm going to try it one more time. These were falling out after about 30 miles. So I'm going to try this again. Stick it in my ear and push. I don't know. That feels a little better this time. I don't know that I like having to Oh no, it's already popping out of my ear. I'm done with these. Goodbye, Alpines. I'll stick with the ones I had yesterday. The last clips that you saw with the other earplugs happened a couple weeks ago. And my favorite ones, I just started to find that they were itching my ear a lot more. I really like how easy they went in, how soft they went in, but the inside of my ear canal was starting to get really, really itchy every single time I wore them. Alex likes these orange earplugs from a long, long time ago, and I happened to find them on Amazon. These ear buddies. 
Today I'm going to give these ear buddies a try. I will tell you that I have already practiced several times putting them in. There is a bit of a fine art to putting them in. And that involves making sure that you twist these very, 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 very small. And then you have to snake it into your ear canal, push it in and then let it expand. And the first few times I could not get it at all. It, they just fell out. But the last two times I've been able to get them super, super tiny and feel them slide in do a little push, and then they stay really nice. So we're gonna get on the bike now. We're gonna be out for a couple hours and I'm gonna see how these work out for me. All right, so I wore these for about 50 miles each way, total of 100 miles, and I love them. They are really, really good. Unintentionally, I guess you would say that I saved the best for last. Here you go. The only con is that there's a little bit of a technique to get them in, but once you get that down pat, they, they open up real nice and fit your ear well. They're very soft. I had no itchiness and the noise dampening is really, really good. I could not hear the wind sound really at all, but I could still hear Alex on the comm systems. I would highly recommend these. I will put all the links below in the order that I liked all of them so that you can get one for yourself. And please subscribe to my channel to follow all my adventures. I hope you liked my personal review of all of these earplugs. Take care, everybody. See you next time.